Think. Out the box entertainment. Hey, this is John Pyatt, and you're tuning in to Clot Open Surgery. So I have a really exciting day right now today. I was waiting for this thing to come in for, I would say a little over a month. It is the blood marrow scroll. The blood marrow scroll is the gift and MacGuffin of the whole season, this particular season. Every season there'll be a MacGuffin. If you don't know what a MacGuffin is, a MacGuffin is uh, a primary goal that all the central characters is after. Um, in Star Wars, it was, in my opinion, it was destroying the Death Star, or the Death Star. Um, at one point, it was Princess Leia. I think it went from Princess Leia to the, uh, destroying the, the Death Star. Um, and in, in, uh, in Alice in Wonderland, it was the Ruby Red Slippers. Um, and so, so, uh, and the discovery of, I guess, the eyes, you know. Um, but for the most part, it is that primary thing that all the subjects, all the characters is after. So, I've been working with this brother for about two to three months now, a, a Da Vinci Young. Um, da Vinci Young, Da Vinci Young. I, I messed up his name because he always messed my name up. And, um, and he, he's the, the creator. Of the, the backs, the bloodhound backs, and I was like, "Yo, dude, you know, I need a scroll, bro. I, I, I need a scroll and I need a book. And this is my idea for the scroll." And, and I had told him, sent him some pictures, and he was like, "Yo, that's a great idea. I love it." And he was like, "Yo, this is what I have in mind. What about if we do this?" And then I just let him just be him, be the artist that he is, and he made a beautiful thing, and it just came in today. I'm revealing it for the first time. I have yet to see it other than the picture. So this is the actual thing. I'm opening it up on camera. Um, he, also, he also said there's a, a special little gift or a surprise or whatever the case is. I don't know what that is. Um, I hate surprises, by the way. All excited and stuff, like it's Christmas. You know, sometimes you come across people and you really don't know who you're working with, you know. Um, and since I, I, you know, especially since you don't, he's he's not in New York City. I'm in New York City, the Bronx. And you don't know who you're working with, you don't know his disposition, you don't know his character, his personality. So. It was a blessing to find him because we really, um, I feel like we, we developed a relationship and, and, and was a mutual respect. And that's good because, you know, I feel like I could talk to him even though we have yet to speak online, uh, rather on the phone and in person. I really feel like a connection is made. And that's good because you want to you wanna work with people who um, kind of understand you and get you. And, um, jeez, this thing is huge. Okay. I've seen some coming through. See something. I'm excited. I feel like a kid. Well, I, I am a big kid, so it is what it is. Did this dude pack this thing or what? Ah, he made a case for it. Nice. You know, he's a really, really gifted talent. And um, he's a real pleasure to work with. Oh, nice. 
weeks. That's nice. He made a he made a heart because the whole thing about the series is they they after after a heart. So that's the heart so far that he made. That's isn't that nice? Look at the design. He put Da Vinci on the top. I'm assuming that's a D. Put a heart with the brain. Yeah, that's hot. That is crazy. That's cr I guess this is the front, right? And then we go. And then it, it, it even makes that noise. Okay, okay. So, wow. This is. Oh, it's heavy too. It has some girth to it. Oh, I love the texture. Yeah, this is crazy. Okay, so we we really need a wide shot for this one. Ah, some of the paint came off. Okay, that's okay. Jeez. Isn't that crazy? And this is the scroll. This is the blood marrow scroll that the boy finds. So let me break this down. This right here is individual numbers. This is from, um, they use the numbers, there's four rings, and they go from um, one to nine, right? And all of them move, which is really cool. Um, and this one right here on top is all the alphabets. Each ring has the whole entire alphabet on it, which is crazy. Because I was like, yo, we, we went through like kind of we, we went back and forth on this idea. He was gonna make more. He was gonna make um, um, less number. He was gonna make less rings to fill out the alphabet, and he made them all. Him and his lady. I, I don't know his lady's name, but uh, she had helped a lot. I, I think with the with the process, and they all move. It's a nice look. And the real trick. The real thing is, what happens is the scroll has the is gonna have um, pictures of the the bloodhounds and um, history and um, some codes in it. So all of this is gonna help break the, the help um, decipher the code. Um, now this this is what I'm really excited for. This part right here. We open it up, and this is hot too. You see that? You even made it like a bone. This right here, this little strip is so important. Oh, they kind of they kind of small. That's okay. Um, it's so important to breaking down the scroll because what will happen is. Like it'll line up, some of it will line up, and then from there I'll return it, and then some other letters will line up, and then I'll turn it again, and it'll work its way down the whole entire scroll. And um, from that, that's nice. And this is the back. A little paint came off, but that's okay. And this is the front, the inside. Blood marrow scroll. So th this is once again a really a, important crack um, to the series, to the it, to the first part of the uh, of the first season. Everybody's looking for this scroll. The boy is the only one who's able to break it down. And um, the main character, the main demon character, Dread, is trying to get his hands on this scroll. And then from there, you know, once he gets his hands on the scroll, then we go into season two. Um, and we deal with that whole issue of why he has the scroll and what he's going to do with it. Um, 
but I really, it's so heavy. The the balls was, was uh, these are balls actually. And okay. So the bones is um, supposed to be di dinosaur bones because this whole thing was made back in Adam and Eve time. So it's really dating back. And then I'll put the history or, or the time frame right down here and on this side. Um, anyway, it's really, really beautiful design. Da Vinci Young um, did an amazing job. I'll put a link to his Facebook and his YouTube channel on the bottom. And this is John Pye once again for uh, open, open, excuse me, John Pye for clot, open surgery. Blood marrow scroll. It's beautiful.